John Roberts grew up in Mississauga and attended Arendelle Secondary School and later enrolled at the University of Toronto's Arendelle College. He first started working in radio at his local college station, CFRE-FM, in Mississauga. John's first professional job was as a reporter and news anchor with CFOS in Owen Sound, Ontario in 1975. From there, Roberts went to radio stations in Kitchener and London before moving back to Toronto to join Top 40 Powerhouse 1050 Chum later that year as a weekday evening disc jockey. 1050 Chum and City TV gave him the honor name J.D. Roberts. In 1979, he branched out from his radio work to co-host with Jeannie Becker a music news magazine titled The New Music on City TV until 1985. In the 1980s, we're likely to see a German invasion with groups like Kraftwerk who have broken new ground in electronic music. Along with your albums, you'll probably be buying a lot of video discs and tapes. During that time, Roberts also served as entertainment reporter for City TV and their local music video show, Toronto Rocks. Coming up next, we have new music from Julian Lennon in his debut solo album on Toronto Rocks. In 1984, John was tapped to front Canada's music channel, Much Music, where he hosted many programs, including a one-hour heavy metal show called The Power Hour. You get the Much Music card, your passport to prizes all year long. By 1987, Roberts had moved from Much Music to anchor City TV's City Pulse Tonight. Between 1989 and 1990, he left Canada to become an anchor and reporter for WFOR-TV, the CBS-owned station in Miami, Florida. However, he returned to his roots in 1990 to co-host the national CTV morning show, Canada AM, initially with Deborah McGregor and later with Pamela Wolin. It wasn't too long before the U.S. came calling again and today, John continues to enjoy his role as one of America's highest profile newscasters. Roberts was with CBS News for 14 years and served as Chief White House Correspondent and Chief Medical Correspondent. Good afternoon from CBS News, this is Newsbreak. He also anchored the weekend editions of CBS Evening News and CBS Morning News. Roberts co-anchored CNN's American Morning from 2007 to 2010. Throughout his career, he has traveled internationally and interviewed numerous prominent figures, including former presidents George W. Bush, George H. W. Bush, and Bill Clinton, along with former Vice President Al Gore, the late Yitzhak Rabin, and Pakistani President Pervez Musharraf. Over the course of his career, Roberts has been a recipient of several awards including a New York Press Club Award and three National Emmy Awards for his coverage of the Atlanta Olympic bombing, the death of Princess Diana, and the TWA crash. John currently serves as the co-anchor of America Reports on Fox News Channel in Washington. Former Vice President of the United States, Mike Pence, your administration released... Uh... His reporting style has made him one of the most respected news reporters in America, and today, Mississauga, the place where his outstanding career all started, is proud to add John Roberts into its Walk of Fame, Legends Road. <laughs>